In Las Cruces, New Mexico, there's a library with no books, but a great story. A library with nothing to read, but that you have to check out. A library for people who just want to take a few minutes to sit down and get lost in a good kitten. Yes, well, I have the sign in and out sheet. And you, you pull one off the shelf? Pull one off the shelf. Becky Garcia is yeah. the kitten librarian. Yeah. Madam of the cat house, whatever. <laughs> wow, let's yeah. go with kitten librarian. Yeah, kitten librarian's yeah. a little yeah. nicer, yeah. <laughs> Actually, oh, wow. what she is is the receptionist here at the Dona Ana County office building where a couple years ago, county officials installed this little kitty condo in the lobby. The cats are from a local shelter, and they're available to any employee looking for a moment of purr bliss. They'll sign me out for some kitty love. Angela Roberson is a community planner and a regular at the kitty library. Oh, oh, you're typing for me, kitty. She readily admits that her productivity goes down during these brief sessions, but says her job satisfaction goes way up. It definitely relieves stress. I mean, how, how could it not when you have a little fuzzy thing that you can take back to your office? It makes what could otherwise be a boring work day kind of fun. I think it shows that the county does care. And cares not just for the welfare of its workers, but for its homeless animals as well. See, when the county set this up, it had a secret agenda. Officials knew if people just took a few minutes to hold these animals, that a bond might form. And in fact, to date, 100 kittens have been adopted from the library. The joy, the smiles, I've seen so many smiles. And it's that kind of outside the cage thinking that folks here would like to spread to other communities across the country. Please do it again, we'll be back. Imagine a nation of libraries catering to those who just want to curl up with a good person.